This is Talk To Me Nice, episode five, y'all. Talk To Me Nice, episode five. You feel what I'm saying? I'm blessed, can't complain. Can't complain at all. You know what I mean? We got a very special crew for y'all tonight, okay? Unfortunately, one of the panelists is not in the building, at least not yet, okay? Unfortunately, one of the panelists is not in the building at the current moment. So if anybody would like to play and participate and turn up with us tonight, y'all, feel free to request the box right now. Hello? Happy motherfucking Tuesday, y'all. Happy motherfucking Tuesday. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, you know I mean, good vibes, good energy in this motherfucking y'all. Totally nice episode five, y'all. You know what I mean? Where we get a chance to learn a little bit more about the streamers. You feel what I'm saying? Get to play some games and have fun while we do it as well. You know what I mean? Shit like that. So, KK, starting with you, baby. Let us know who you are, what time you stream, what you got going on in the app. You know what I mean? The basics. Hey, everybody. My name is K motherfucking K. Um, I'm mainly a night streamer, but I'm trying to get on to like, you know, morning scene or whatever. Um, I am still fairly new trying to get, you know, the ropes, you know, situated on here. I'm an admin for Top Badge Rello and Fame's um, featured show, Two Lies, One Truth. So if you guys want to be on it, just hit me up. And yeah, thanks, L, for having me. I appreciate it. So walk uh, CEO. I see I'm just a business being a streamer as well, so. I stream whenever because um, I'm always just editing. So normally I'm not even in the screen, so you just see me editing. But it's whenever, late nights I have my um, stream on with all the stuff that I've done as far as videos, graphics, and things of that nature. You feel me? This big Honda, you feel me? Big Honda, Honda. Uh, I ain't really be streaming out here. I, I'm just now getting active like last two weeks, you feel me? I do music, I do clothes, you feel me? Custom streaming shirts, if you need some shirts for your stream, some clothes for your shit, hoodies, some shorts, all of that type of shit. You feel me? Uh, I don't really stream like that, but I'm about to get active. Right. He said what the hell he said, y'all. He said what he said. So these are three out of four of the panelists for tonight, y'all. Like I said, we got one spot left. We're about to fill that slot right now as well, too, y'all. We're going to get a chance to know these streamers a little bit better, have some fun while we're doing it, y'all. Talk to me nice. Episode five, all right? So we're going to get this shit started nice and slow, you know what I'm saying, just to see where you guys' heads is at. And, um, yeah, pick your brains a little bit and just get this thing started, okay? So I'm going to ask you guys a phrase, right? I'm going to give you guys a phrase. Without giving the correct answer you guys are going to basically fill in the blanks with um anything like that that's not the correct answer okay so kk started with you thank you for the will too all right live each day to the maximum okay so why uh, same thing brother live each day to till whenever <laughs> okay I'm done my guy same exact phrase my same exact phrase live each day you know what i mean live each day to die all right all right they said what the hell they said they said what the hell they said like i said without answering this one correctly y'all without answering it correctly you feel what i'm saying that's all we want to know so i'm gonna give you one more and then we're gonna get ready to get this thing started yo joe my guy appreciate you for clapping into as well too you know what i mean yo what up though what up though what up people know who you are what's going on yeah, it's your boy, not your average motherfucking Joe. You know what I'm saying? Right now, I'm on a backup, but it's basically the same setup, you know what I'm saying, on my main page. I'm on, I'm on solitary, but I was able to get a work release for the night, you know what I mean? So I'm whenever screaming. I get back out, y'all already know what to do. Come holla at me, you know what I'm saying? If y'all got extra y'all got extra commissary, you know what I'm saying? Slide that under the gate, you feel me? Yeah, okay. Sorry. <laughs> he said, what the fuck? He said, he said what he said. So not your average job, I'm start with you, okay? You're going to fill in the blanks without giving the correct answer, right? This I person that. this person is skating on thin. On skin liquid, I don't know. Okay, fuck it. It is what it is. It is what it is. You know what I mean? Hun done. This person is busy as a... This person is busy as a, as a bee. You know what I mean, that'll be the correct answer, but oh damn, <laughs> busy, as a, busy as a motherfucker, man. Shit, it's busy as a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> it is what the hell it is. So, wag, my guy, this thing is as light as a bowling ball. Fuck it, all right, that's bowling ball. KK, read, read between the pages. Read between the pages and just like that, let's get this thing started. I mean, let's get this thing started. If you guys are ready for a good show tonight, like I said, y'all spam any emoji you want in the comments right now. Favorite everybody with any emoji. Favorite everybody in the panel all night. You know what I mean? Let's get them active. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So just like that, nice and slow. Nice and slow. KK. 
Would you rather find true love today or win the lottery next year? Win the lottery next year. Okay. All right. Same question, my guy. To wag. Would you rather find true love today or win the lottery next year? Honestly, find true love today because I can always make money. Okay. Start a family. Yeah, of course. I need that money. I ain't gonna hold you. Okay, straight to the point. My instant reaction is going to go to the money, for sure. Like, yeah, I want the money. So why, my guy, would you rather spend a week in the forest or a night in a real haunted house? No, I'm from Jamaica, I'm from the woods, so I spent a week in the forest. I'm going to the blood clot forest. I'm done. I do the house, do the house. I, I take the house. I don't, I don't believe in I don't believe in none of the duppy argument. I don't believe in no no ghosts and ghouls and goblins. I don't believe in that. So before I stay out in the in the woods getting bit my mosquitoes for a week, let me just let me cop a room in a in a haunted joint. Haunted house. I ain't trying to get bit by no mosquitoes, get you know, no poison ivy type shit. You know, I'll cuddle <laughs> with the ghost. I'll cuddle with the ghost for 24 hours. I'm done. Would you rather? get trapped in the middle of a food fight or get trapped in the middle of a water balloon fight? A water balloon fight. Nice and simple. Nice and simple. You know what I mean? Joe. Nah, nah. Food fight, yo. Food fight. Water be balloon because if I'm wearing some me a nice outfit and I get, you know, my stuff stained, oh, I'm whooping some ass. Would you rather die before or after your spouse, your partner? Would you rather die before or after your partner? I can't take that. I can't take that pain. I'm not about to, you know what I'm saying? I can't, I'm not about to be walking around knowing that my heart is in the, nah, yo. That shit is breaking my heart right now. I'm about to cry. <laughs> Facts. That's a fact, but hey, that's what we gotta know, man. We gotta know, you find what I'm saying? KK, same question, baby. Would you rather die before or after your partner? After. I gotta say after. I gotta make sure the kids, uh, insurance and all that, and trust fund is taken care of. So I gotta make sure that's planned out in the future. Then I can go. Right, say no more. Undone. Yeah, I ain't gonna hold you. I'm gonna die after, cause like hell no, nah. like she ain't gonna have no my kids calling the next nigga daddy. Out of everybody in this panel right now, who is the most likely to be written about in future history books? Out of everybody in this panel right now, who is the most likely to be written about in future history books? So why? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Going with him, hundred percent. So, why, my guy? What do you say? Who do you say? Who is the most likely to be read about in future history books? If I'm going off of just personality right now, I'm going off with a comedy and what I heard, bro. I don't even know how to say your name, but your backup account, fill in. <laughs> Not your average Joe. Not your average Joe. You feel what I'm saying, Joe? <laughs> Not your average motherfucking Joe. So, I right, look. uh yeah, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying, hate me or love me, but it's me, right? I'm gonna say KK, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know they usually get the right day story, you know what I'm saying? I would say to walk too. Okay, okay. It's going down, it's going down, it's going down. Yo, just like that, like I said, if y'all enjoying the vibe so far, y'all spam any emoji y'all want. It's your favorite, everybody with any emoji throughout the night, y'all favorite, everybody in the panel throughout the goddamn night. You feel what I'm saying? I have everybody in this panel right now, who is the most likely to start a heist? I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Hundun. He got money in his name, so why wouldn't he be the one <laughs> to be like, "Yo, I got the play. Here's the lick." You know what I mean? Respectfully, me. I ain't gonna cap. Respectfully. <laughs> <laughs> respectfully. Respectfully. I ain't gonna cap it down. Respectfully. Just like respectfully. that, y'all guys. One of y'all me's for the team, okay? As there's four of y'all in the goddamn team right now, but you guys only get three times to use a me card, and that was one of them. So you guys only get to choose yourselves two more times. As a team, you guys only have two left, right? <laughs> To wag my guy. I say, honestly, I say, hun, that nigga came in here darker already, so you already know, trying to find his face. Oh man, KK. Joe. 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 To wag my guy. <laughs> if the police break down your door, do they have to pay for the damage? Oh yeah. And I'll show them that receipt for that shit. Plus, uh, it was cameras around anyway, and my ring light would show them my, like, my, my ring would show them why they fucked up. Oh, yeah. I'm going to bring them the Home Depot receipt for all the tools and all the supplies I had to, you know, buy to fix it. Okay. Reimburse me, please. Hell yeah, they're going to pay. And I'm going to get my money back already before they even pay me because YouTube is going to go crazy. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to send it all over YouTube. It's going to go crazy. I'm going to get my money. And my man, Tawab, going to edit it up. Tawab, going to edit it up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 
to make it look extra spicy. He gonna put the effects on. Boom! Y'all gonna be the oh shit! What they did to this nigga? Hell oh, yeah, they got baby. KK, if you had to listen to one song for the rest of your life, what is the one song you are going to listen to? Wet Dreams by J. Cole. Jesse Powell, you. Uh, uh, one of my songs. I can't think of it yet, but it's gonna be one of my songs. So, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be it's gonna be Michael Jackson PYT, man. I can listen to that every day for the rest of my life. All right. And they said what the fuck they said, man. It's a goddamn um, selection of songs for real, y'all. Goddamn selection of songs right here. You feel what I'm saying? All right, now let's get a little interesting. Like I said, we do want to get into y'all heads a little bit, see what y'all thinking about and shit like that too, just to, nah, let me get to know the streamers a little bit better, you feel what I'm saying? So, Kai, I see you, to wag. If you had a time machine, bro, if you had a time machine that actually worked, what time period would you like to visit and why? Uh, interesting, uh, and honestly, uh, I could see all the history that they, they try to hide. So I do for myself, I die. Whatever like slavery times was, like right before they got us on the boat, I'd have been the one that gonna be like, yo, we gonna beat this nigga ass. Like, why are we getting on this nigga boat? Like, fuck y'all talking. We about to go over there. We don't even know nobody over there. Cause like, what <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> we on that nigga ass, oh God. What are you talking about? <laughs> We got that nigga ass. What? What was we leaving for, God? I'm gonna go like to the. I'm gonna go like to the 30s and 40s, right before they was giving black people their little space, but they ain't had the technology to catch niggas and shit yet. I'm, I'm gonna be the ultimate gangster, but I'm also gonna be militant. You know what I'm saying? So I'm gonna be burning shit down, robbing banks. You know what I'm saying? Helping people get literacy. You know what I'm saying? Sending motherfuckers to school. I mean, coming up. You know what I'm saying? Knocking over all of the trains. Sorry, KK. You know what I mean? But yeah, I'm knocking over everything. Holy shit. I'm gonna fast forward to my future because I want to oh, see, good, good. You know, I wanna see what it has to hold. You know what I'm that saying? That was a good like, answer. If you only had experience one season for the rest of your life, spring, summer, fall, or winter, which one would it be? Ooh, winter. Winter, bro. Winter is a big boy. What? And you you feel me, bro? But I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say fall. You know what I mean? Niggas can still put on the Tim's, throw the hoodie on, you know what I'm saying? Still get to do shit, but it ain't too cold. It's nice. Yeah, I'm gonna say the fall. Okay. And it's football season. Let's go. I gotta say fall too, cause it's like it's not too hot, not too cold. It's just right to where you know you don't have to wear like 18 layers, but at the same time you don't have to be like in a tank top and shorts. I like being and cold, still, and like the sun still be out. Right. Mm-hmm. So wag, my guy. Same question. Man, I'm an olive boy. I need that heat, that sun. I don't care. I still take hot showers, so I take summer all day, every day. All right. Straight to the point. Straight to the goddamn point. Joe! Out of everything you've learned about everybody in this box right now, who is the most likely to get up and move to a foreign country right now? I'm going to say T. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Cause, cause right. he just hop on the plane and go right back home. That's a foreign country. You know what I'm saying? Me and him both. Go to Jamaica in, in, in no time. Hey man, I see you getting to wag, my guy. Same as that question. Who is the most likely to get up and go to a foreign country right now? I'm out of here. Honestly, uh, I'm gonna use that me card. But I mean, I go with me because my whole goal is to um, get a dual session back in Jamaica in the country of Africa. So definitely appreciate that, bro. Say no more. Say no more. You found playing as a team. You guys have one me part left as a team. I can see Hundun, you know, with his music, you know, I can see him taking it to another place and, you know, elevating his platform. Yeah, okay. baby. Yeah. Talk nice. That Talk was rich. Nice. That was rich. That was like, rich. <laughs> you already see it in me. From New York to Texas already, if y'all ain't know. You feel me? We from New York, but we in Texas right now. I love that answer. I love you. So he said, he said, we said, if y'all enjoying the vibes and y'all want to be on one of the next episodes, y'all, if y'all want to be on next week's episode, feel free to tap in, hit me up on Instagram, ASAP, we'll definitely get y'all in that motherfucker, you know what I mean? Get y'all motherfuckers in that motherfucker, you feel what I'm saying? You know what I mean? All right, <clears throat> let's get a little interesting right now. So who is the one person who is bold enough to volunteer for this question right here? Who's the one person bold enough to volunteer? All right, I seen Hundun's hand first. Around everybody in the panel right now, who is the most likely to have sex with someone in public? Yeah. I got Joe. I got Joe. 
Okay. He sent that shit straight to fucking Joe. I have to say KK. I just have to. <laughs> I'm not doing it because he said it, but the first thing that came to mind was you, Joe. Okay. Two for fucking Joe. It is what it is. To wag, my guy. Same question, man. Who's the most likely to have sex with somebody in public? No, son. I'm not trying to pick one. <laughs> I gotta say, huh? So, Tawag, you know what I mean? I've been noticing, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and I noticed that your hand was the one that didn't go up. So, I'm going to ask this question to you first. I'm asking my blood. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, his excuse came way too fast. Out of everybody in the box right now, man, out of everybody in the box right now, who is the most likely to drunk text their ex? Who is the most likely to drunk text their ex? <laughs> <laughs> Been there, done that. I can see, hun. I'm sorry. Okay, okay. And shit like that. Damn. Shit like that. baby. Yo, Joe, who was the most likely to drunk text the ex? <laughs> it's KK, and she te- and she drunk texting song lyrics from '90 R&B shit. You know what's crazy? Cause my answer. I had to I had to walk for the same opposite answer. I feel like he be texting his bitches some burner border. What do you think? Oh my shot. Okay, baby. What would you do if you only had 24 hours left to live? I mean, like what Mila said, that was the first thing that came to my head because I'm gonna make sure my people are straight. You know, everybody that's in my circle circle, I'm gonna make sure they're good. Right. I'm gonna leave behind what I can for them and you know. Wish them the life that they want to live. The first thing that popped in my head was actually make as much money to get my mom so that she can take care of whatever bills or whatever I'm going. I ain't got no kids right now, right? I'm team fuck them kids, but I feel like if I had 24 left, I gotta go nut and some shit. So like, <laughs> I have to junior. I, I gotta leave behind. Oh. Like I gotta leave behind. Son said he's not dying in Gildan. Son right, said he's me? not dying in Gildan. Like, y- y'all gonna see me again, oh God. Y'all gonna see me again. When you tell me I got 24 hours, I'm breaking down. I'm gonna be angry. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? I'm like, gonna go through all the stages, and then probably at the end, I'm gonna start being rational, and be like, yo, I gotta go get bread, but then I'm being my fifth hour, so I'm probably just gonna be in some pussy. So it's just gonna be a waste of a day. It's just gonna be a whole fucking waste. I'm done. <clears throat> If you had to choose one person in the comments right now that you would want to see on next week's episode, who would it be? <laughs> okay. Uh, man, I would definitely, it would probably be like a toss up between like uh, Lotus and Barry. Okay. Between them two. Okay. Say no more. Say no more. KK. Mila. 100%. So why? Color me. Color me. Yo, Mila. You heard what the people said, man. You heard what the people said. They want to see your ass on next week's episode. So tap the fuck in. Let's see what the fuck we got going on. You know what I mean? Let's see what the fuck we got going on. You feel what I'm saying? Everybody in the goddamn comments, feel free to, like I said, participate in the comments as well, too. Like I said, your goddamn comments, emojis, everything matters. Everything fucking matters. So yeah, make sure you stay active. Get the fuck up in there. You know what I mean? Thursday night, y'all. Thursday night. That ain't your motherfucking homie. Episode five, you feel what I'm saying? We got goddamn sponsors in the building as well and shit like that too. If you want to be a sponsor for one of those goddamn shows and shit like that too, feel free to tap in. Start this motherfucker back up. Who would like to volunteer for this one right here? I'll do it. She said fucking me. All right, I'm so glad you said that. You said that fast as hell. You use your time to your advantage. So let's use your time and answer this question. What would you do if you found out that you can stop time? Yeah, I would probably break the rules, you know? break the laws and shit do what i can to live what i you know all that she's a sweetheart y'all she's 100 sweetheart because me i'm 100 breaking the rules i'm just telling you that right now so wag my guy what you gonna do if you <laughs> stop time man what the hell you gonna do if i can stop the time and I, I get with no evidence and I clean that shit up. If I fucked up somewhere, I can go back and clean up real quick and <laughs> my mind that black card faster. So yeah, I'm robbing a couple banks. I don't give a fuck. But the government already robbed me enough time. Yeah, no cap though. Like you gotta get what I'm robbing mad banks. Mad banks, bro. Mad banks, not one. <laughs> but I'm slapping people that need to be slapped, you feel me? Like you feel me my pops, you definitely gotta get a two piece, you feel me? Yo, look, I'm gonna get off camp for this one because I don't really like the whole repeating shit. So I'm about to be on some big freak shit, like all the little jumps, you know what I'm saying? With the, with the wagons, I'm gripping booties and then going right back where I'm at, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Stop at time, you know what I'm saying? Walk up in the motherfucking, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm doing all type of freak shit. Now, I'm gonna take this one right here to the audience. Who do y'all wanna see answer this question first right now? Yeah, who do y'all wanna see answer this question first right now? You know what I mean? 
they cutting up. They cutting the fuck up. Oh, 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 oh. Cut Yo, hit man, we ain't we ain't messing with your answers, hit man. <laughs> uh, no, hey, man. Behind done, man. Man. Yeah. Behind, behind, done, and this motherfucker <laughs> undone. My guy, it's the one. What's up, though? Who is the most likely in this panel to date someone twice their age? I, I feel like Joe going to take it for the bag. I feel like Joe going to take it for the bag. Oh, God. Big motherfucker. I'm the big motherfucker. You could have known me. I'm putting it on KK. I'm putting it on KK. I'm pretty sure somebody granddad done got a piece already. I can, I can see her. Definitely Joe. Definitely Joe. Definitely Twag, my guy. Who is the most likely to have the most children? My guy, they done sent that shit to you, bro. They sent that shit straight to you. You feel what I'm saying? <laughs> Who's the most likely to have the most children? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was going to say KK. You know what I'm saying? I was going to say KK. <laughs> But you know what I'm saying? Nah, I'm gonna put it on T. Cause you know what I'm saying? He Jamaican just like me. So I'm pretty sure he got three kids and three baby moms. I'm sorry, but I gotta go with Tawag. I gotta go with Tawag. Oh, shoot. Okay. I, I do want a lot of kids. I just had none right now. I want a baby mom because I want to play. <laughs> Shout out to you, brother. Shout out to you. Ladies, he ain't come to play around, man. I'm saying he ain't come to fucking play around. Undone. My guy, who was the most likely to have the most babies? <laughs> motherfucker. Yeah, I got Tawag, buddy. I feel like once he finds his shorty, he gonna dump him. Hey, he yo, he, 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 he not, he not, he not, he not pulling out the parking lot, gang on guy. He not pulling out the driveway. Who is the most likely to be late to their own birthday party? Oh. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say Hundun. I'm gonna say Hundun probably be the nigga that be late to his own birthday party. I got uh, Joe this time. The reason I'm saying is because I manage a DJ and we do, and I deal with a lot of artists. I do photography artists. So, hun, these fools want to show up late just to show that extra red carpet BS. I don't got time for that shit. So, yeah, definitely hun. <laughs> Hundo was in my head. I have to say, Joe, because I can already see he did him being late to be somewhere. KK Baby. Ooh, if you had to choose one person in this box right now, you can only choose one person in this box right now. You want to see them on the next episode. Who is it going to be? Hundun. You want to see Hundun on another one, y'all? We got one for Hundun. Hundun. Same question, man. If you had to choose one motherfucker in this goddamn box right now, you want to see them back on the show again. Who the hell is it going to be? Who the hell is it going to be? I'm going to go for my gang, Joe, man. Okay. Say no more. Say no more. Joe, my guy, who would you want to see back on this motherfucker? Yeah, we're gonna, we gonna, you know what I'm saying? We just gonna frisbee that motherfucker back down, done, bro. All right, say that, say that. So, why? Right, if you had to choose one in this motherfucker that you wanna see back on this motherfucker, who would it be? Just to keep it all even, I'll say, uh, K. Okay, say that. Just to balance it out. Just to balance that motherfucker out. Undone. People's choice right now so far. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, sure, yeah. Sure. Teams are most likely in here to be dating three people at one time. I got, I got K. I'm sorry, like, you know, I've had my dealings. With Jamaican men, Joe. I'm sorry. Bumble Cloud, <laughs> Joe. Who's the most likely to date three people at the same time? Nah, man. Like she's like she like she just said. Clearly, she had her dealing with Jamaican men. And she <laughs> know how that shit go. So it's definitely KK. KK no. <laughs> just for the record, I would have took it for everybody. If y'all voted me, I wouldn't mind. But. Honestly, I, I said it. I, I this is a part of my head before anybody oh. else went. But honestly, I can see KK doing it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. That's and and, 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 and all y'all ain't here. All y'all ain't here know that. Who is the most likely out of this panel to become a millionaire? Okay. Who is the most likely to be the first one to become a millionaire in this panel? Tawag. Okay. Tawag. My God. Same question, brother. Same exact question. Uh, honestly, if, if Hundun really promote himself properly, like I said, I deal with artists, then I can see him doing that. Okay, say no more. Say no more. Undone. Yo, Same okay, question. Yo. Who's the most likely to become a millionaire? Something serious. The love, Ginger. I definitely appreciate the love, Ginger. But I, I definitely know that shit. That, that video editing shit. You feel me? That shit definitely. You feel me? Take time and patience. You can run that racks off of that shit fast as fuck. Even if you work with niggas that's ass, you feel 
Tomorrow morning, y'all. Tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. Eastern time, y'all. Double versus everybody, y'all. If you have some good music and you want to battle me, you think you can battle me in some goddamn songs and shit like that, so let's see if you got what it takes to beat me in these song battles. You feel what I'm saying? Thursday night, y'all. Thursday night. That ain't your motherfucking homie game show, y'all. 10 p.m. Eastern time. You don't want to miss that motherfucker. Make sure you pull up, see what the vibes is and shit like that, too. We're going to be turning up, see which team knows each other better. You feel what I'm saying? If you want to be a sponsor, feel free to tap in. I'll um, give you some information. You can get up in there as well, too, okay? Now, this is the very last Mila. question. This is the very last question for Talk To Be Nice, episode five. Who is the one that's volunteering to, you know what I mean? Take this one for the team and go first. Who thinks they have what it takes? I'm done. I'm so glad you guys did this. I see a whole lot of participation. This is the very last question. Like I said, I'm done. Oh, and we can meet. If you had to choose. What's the vibe? One person, yeah. If you had to choose one person in this box right now, I know everybody just became friends with best friends with each other. We cool as hell now, ain't we? We cool as a motherfucker. You know what I mean? If you had to choose one person in this box right now to never be on this show again, who would it be? Okay. <laughs> I thought we were friends. Hey, you my dog. You my hey, dog, K. Okay, same as that question, baby, same as that question. Who would it be? If somebody had to go and they can never come back, who the fuck would it be? Joe. <laughs> Joe, my God. <laughs> if you had to pick one person that could never come back to this motherfucker, Joe, who the fuck would it be? It would be me, because this is my backup, so I'm never coming back on this motherfucker. So when I do come back, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's going to be my regular shit. And that is a Hold great that. way to use your last B card. That is a great way to use your last B card. So, Wang, unfortunately, there are no B cards left. If you had to choose <laughs> one person on the panel to never come back to the show again, you found saying no hard feelings. That'd be all right. Who would it be? You know what they say. Bro, no one knows. You know what <laughs> Do it. Do it. Yo! Do it. I feel attacked. Do it. Are you? Just because I'm the only lady here. Damn, man. Thank you, bro. Not too much of my motherfucker. Hey, hey, maybe you should get your friend Lotus and KK to come up here. Uh, 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 Barry to come up here. You know what I mean? They would be so alone. Know what I mean? Ladies, I gotta get some revenge, huh? The ladies said they're coming back for some fucking revenge. If any of you need to come back, they're gonna whip y'all fucking ass. Yo, if y'all enjoyed episode five, y'all spam any fucking emoji y'all want. Fat Cooch, I see you. If y'all enjoyed episode five, spam any emoji y'all want, y'all. You know what I mean? KK, let us know who you are, what time you stream, what you got going on. Mulatto! What's hey, up, everybody? My name's K motherfucking K. Um, I'm a nighttime streamer, but I stream at night. I'm starting to get into the, you know, morning time thing. Um, I'm an admin. <laughs> I'm still laughing at to log though. But anyways, um, I'm an admin for Top Adrello and Fame Show Two Lies One Truth. So if you guys wanna get on that, you know my Instagram is in bio. And yeah. And she said what she said. She said what the fuck she said. So log, my guy, what you got going on on the app? You know what I mean? Shit like that. Like I said, I'm all about business right now. So if y'all come my live and I'm not there, um. Just say something. I'm most likely I'm doing something. But don't forget to tune in Thursday. Make sure you tune in my homeboy show because I'll be recording it. This show I also record, so I'll chop it up. I'm gonna send it to him as well so y'all can see. Most likely on um, uh, IG Reels gonna be all these funny ass, dumb ass comments that Joe and Kay and the guns gonna bag each other gonna be on there, so. <laughs> I mean, this was definitely an episode for the book, y'all. This is definitely an episode for the book. I'm done, my guy. Good vibes, man. Big hunt done. Big hunt for you, feel me? From New York, we out here in Texas, man. All I got going on that app, you feel me? Lavish game, you see my dude Kai in the comments, you feel me? I tapped in last week and I'm here this week, you feel me? So, you know the vibes, you feel me? Big New York City, you feel me? We out here in Texas. Go check my music out on all platforms. That's Hunted Flow Hess, H-U-N-N-I-D. Low has eight E S S. You feel me? Has like the old gas station. I shit speedway now, so fuck all that. On the flow has you feel me? Go check my shit out on all platforms. But you know the vibes, you feel me? Live is game. Shout out my nigga Kai. Shout out my nigga DCD Pop. Appreciate the vibes, man. Appreciate the opportunity. You feel me? Definitely appreciate the vibes. Thank you, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Oh, Cause just gave us a whole album outro. Hello, as he should, sure? as he fucking should. Sure? Joe, my guy. You already know the deal. It's your boy, not your average motherfucking Joe. Um, of course, y'all can catch me on my regular page. You know what I'm saying? 
uh, nightly, you know what I'm saying, 10 to whenever, you know what I'm saying? We do got the fall asleep streams. We do that too, you know what I mean? So you can come through and catch us doing that. Uh, outside of that, you know what I'm saying? I am the cyber skin plug. So if y'all need some booties, come holler at me because I'm, you know what I'm saying? I'm shipping them shits out. You know what I'm saying? I got them, got them by the boatload. You know what I'm saying? The cyber skins is in. You know what I'm saying? We got light skins, we got dark skins, we got them all. Don't put them on cam because you're going to end up in solitary like me. Hit this panel with the faves right now. If you have not done it already, y'all, they came through, they turned the fuck up. You feel what I'm saying? Some of them might have been nervous. Like, what the fuck is he going to ask? You know what I mean? But we got a chance to find out a little bit more about our favorite streamers and have fun at the same fucking time. You feel what I'm saying? That's what the show is all about, you know what I mean? Talk show slash game show. Cut the football every fucking Tuesday night, 10 p.m. Eastern time, y'all. So y'all make sure you tap in if y'all want to be on the show too. This was an episode for the books. You see, this was hands down the you know what I mean the best episode so far. They're supposed to be getting better and better. It's supposed to be getting better and better, and we just turn it up. We turn it up. Wait till y'all see some of the cast we have for next week, though, y'all. Wait till y'all see the cast we have for next week.